Welcome teams to First Lego League's Animal Allies robot game. Do we need animals or do they need us? Answer, yes. This robot game showcases just a fraction of our wonderful story with animals. As you work on the missions, pay attention to the many ways innovation and technology have enabled humans and animals to exchange help, friendship, amusement, protection, and love. As you'll see, there are many fun problems left to solve. Shark shipment. The shark starts in its tank, balanced, not touching the walls of the tank. The robot has three opportunities for points. It can push the tank into this rectangle or into this rectangle for more points. But you can get serious points if the delivered shark isn't touching the tank walls. Service dog action. The robot needs to travel east between the barriers and completely cross the fence. As the fence gets pushed down, the dog sits like she would in real life if a car was coming. Animal conservation. Before the match starts, you put an animal on the switching model by hand. The reindeer model starts in base for that purpose, but you can use another animal if you like. From there, no more hands. The actual mission is for the robot to switch animals, loading and unloading as needed. Each animal switched counts for both teams. At the end of the match, the referee is going to be counting pairs of identical animals on a common field. And again, both teams get credit for every new pair. Feeding. The refrigerator is set up with the color randomized stack of food pieces inside. It's the robot's job to take the food out and distribute it to certain animal areas. Points are earned for each piece. It doesn't matter which area a color goes to, as long as the colors aren't mixed in that area. It's possible to do this mission without sensors, but mastery of sensors would save time. Biomimicry. The robot needs to hang this mechanical gecko on the test wall. Instead, or for additional points, the robot itself can hang on the wall. Milking automation. The robot needs to guide this cow into the cowicell and then turn it until milk comes out. Pushing the lever too far causes manure to come out. You still get points if both come out, but it's worth more points to get only milk. Panda release. The model starts closed counterclockwise. It's the robot's job to close it clockwise instead, which shows a panda on the mat going back into the wild. Camera recovery. The robot needs to get this camera back to base. Training and research. Here, there are many opportunities for points. One is to bring the dog and trainer from base out to this rectangle. Another is to bring the zoologist to the same rectangle from the pandas area. And finally, points are earned for each manure sample delivered to that rectangle. This should be quite a challenge because you're only allowed to transport one disc at a time. Beekeeping. The robot needs to get the bee onto the beehive and the honey must come out. If the honey ends up in base, that's worth more points. Prosthesis. The robot needs to bring this pet, who is missing her legs, to base. There, the team will hand install a wheeled prosthesis for her. For added points, the robot can deliver her to the farm area, where she will have fun playing with other animals for the rest of her life. Seal in base. By the end of the match, the seal needs to be in base and not broken. Milk in base. The robot needs to get all three milk cylinders to base. Milk on ramp. The robot needs to get all three milk onto the ramp or onto the ramp in an unaided fashion or onto the ramp in an unaided fashion with all three standing. All samples. The robot gets enhanced points if it's able to get all the manure samples to the target rectangle. Again, you're only allowed to transport one disc at a time. That's our game. We hope you have as much fun playing it as we did making it. Visit www.firstlegoleague.org for more resources to help you. And watch your team email blasts for tips and information about events near you. The Animal Allies season is brought to you in part by our global sponsors, 3M, NI, Rockwell Automation, and of course, Lego.